people don't see this part it's five o'clock in the morning heading to work pulling out of driveway now to head to work so we can uh so i can get the ball rolling today it's gonna be a great day be a great day today Barbara Hendra Condo today, we're going to show you how we do alignments. Uh, alignments are very important, uh, maintains the life expectancy of the tire. Tires are very expensive. The set of tires on this support here, roughly $650. Um, so a once a year alignment check and performance will help maintain the life of those tires. Um, there's plenty of potholes, railroad tracks, I'm sure you've jumped over. And over time that will cause uh, your line to start coming out. So we need to check and make sure your camber and your toe are in specification to maximize your tire life. Today we're using our brand new Hunter uh, machine. It's a Hawkeye Elite. Uh, pretty the top of the line model here. So uh, we can perform the best alignment for you with the best equipment. I'll show you how it's done. Alright, so this is the spec, the measurements we just took with the new machine. Um, this particular vehicle um, is out. Our red numbers indicate that we need to make some adjustments. Um, looking at this car, it looks like the customer must have hit something on the left side and knocked the alignment out a little bit. Um, these numbers here will cause a little bit more of a toe wear issue, which decreases the life of your tires. Your camber which is within spec in this vehicle, is the direction of the tires from the top leaning in and out. All right, so now that we have an analyzer alignment, I'm going to lift it to go ahead and make our adjustments. So now I'm going to perform a rear toe adjustment. So after centering my steering wheel, I'm going to make the proper adjustments here um, using our machine. So are we done with the alignment, Chris? Yep. Left. Next thing we do, what we need to do now is uh, reset our onboard systems. Vehicles have steering angle sensors, especially new cars. And with our machine, we can properly set up your steering angle after making uh, alignment adjustments. All right, this is the Hunter code link box. It plugs into the OBD connector. We'll go ahead and plug that in. Now that we're completed with our update, get a printout, run with the machine, test drive the vehicle, and deliver the car back to the customer.